mouse. It's, it's almost time to eat. You gonna cook us a little something something? We'll call this video cooking with mouse. What? Oh, you didn't agree to that? I don't think she agreed to that. Anyway. We're gonna have us some delicious. I'm trying to move slowly. We're gonna have us some delicious chili bones. Yeah. I like to use Bush's Chili Magic Chili Starter, traditional mild. Just add meat and tomatoes. So I have a pound of hamburger here, I bite in bulk, and just uh, freeze it in sandwich bags. And uh, we got our tomatoes. I like them all you diced. Basil, garlic, and oregano. You know, that would be fine just by itself. But I like to cook it up a notch. Just, like, put, some, put some onions in here when I uh, fry the hamburger. I put I add onion. Well, actually, I put the onion first and then I put the hamburger. And then I'm going to put some black olives in there. Not the whole can, probably about half. Half a can of black olives. I'm going to chop them up. And uh, probably about half this mushroom. Uh, I also like to sometimes sneak mushrooms into meatloaf. I also like to sneak them into the meat, uh, black olives and meatloaf too. Kids don't know. They don't tell them. Alright, we, we got our stuff out. Oh, here's my house. I'm going to pan back down. You ready to cook? You ready to cook? She just wants butter. She's doing her, give me butter meow. Butter? You want butter? Yeah, she does. Alright. Yeah, butter. Let me get the cat some butter and let's get some dinner growing. Okay, so I've uh, browned the onions a little bit. There's, there's a fancy word for this. I don't know what it is right now, but we'll just call it brown the onions a little bit. And uh, get ready to put our hamburger in. And then you know, just cook your hamburger like, like you regularly would. And we'll be back when that's done too. Okay, now hamburger browning. I forgot to add that when I was like uh, browning those onions, that I put a little olive oil on the bottom of the pan. And I think the world for browning onions is called caramelized. So we have like caramelized onions and then we have hamburger. Brown. Okay. I'm not very good at cooking tutorials. I'm not Paula Dean. <laughs> Bear with me. Okay, so I chopped up some of these medium black olives, about half a can. <laughs> and I also chopped up the mushroom pieces and stems, also about half a can. Here we got our chili magic ready to go. Oops, I spilled it. It's like the cat I bit my foot. She's mad. I did not give her enough butter. Oh, Lord. I need an assistant. Sous chef. I need a sous chef. So you made a man. And then you just add the tomatoes. You don't drain it. You just put the whole can in there. Alright. Like all this. And the mushrooms. And then we'll give that a stir and let the heat about 15 20 minutes and we're good to go. I forgot to tell you when you heat that about 15 20 minutes, you probably want to do that on like low or like medium low. And I'll put this on about four and a half to let the flavors mingle in together. You might have noticed that Mrs. Salt got a divorce. She shacked up with Mr. This Mr. Pepper. <laughs> well, this kid, my, my kid dropped my Mr. Pepper shaker into the floor and busted it all to pieces. So now, and Mrs. Salt is a single lady. She's been searching eBay for her potential Mr. Pepper. Right, Miss Salt? Yeah, looking for my new man. She's looking for her new man. Uh, all right. Yep, let's get the lid on here and let this simmer, and I'll clean up my mess over here. Okay? Yeah. 
<laughs> we'll pan down and look at the cat begging for more butter. Maybe when the supper gets done, I'll get you some more butter. Uh, we're going to have some corn muffins. So I know I'm going to get the butter back out of the refrigerator and she's going to want some then too. You have to wait a little bit. No, no, yes, yes. I make the rolls. Yes, you will wait. Maybe in a little bit. Huh. Okay, we got our corn muffins made and baked. And I have our, our chili beans. And we're going to top that with some sour cream I have left over from our, our tacos. And usually I use cheddar on top, cheddar cheese. Sometimes mozzarella, just whatever cheese I have on hand. This is we're having taco blend cheese. So, yep, time to eat, kids. Mouse will be back as soon as I get the butter out. She hears the top pop off that plastic container. She'll be in here. All right, let's eat. All right, I have given Tristan the task of painting this happy Easter sign. And uh, I put in about some paint. And we're gonna put it over the over top of the TV right here. So right here, it's gonna go right there. And I changed out the, the wintery animals, and we put up some uh, bunny rabbits I got from Dodgy. So we'll be right back in a few minutes and uh, check his progress. Okay. Okay. Okay, Tristan finished his painting projects for today. I'm gonna put that string back through that and uh, find a place for uh, the turtle as soon as it dries. He did a good job. Although I think I might add a googly eye to that rabbit to make it cuter. Or a pom pom on the butt. We'll see. Okay, so I put uh, Mr. Turtle there. Hi, Kelly. You need to wash your mirror. I probably do. Put Mr. Turtle there in the door room. He's over here with that that little thing that uh, little angel got Gibby Gal sent me, Leslie. We got that. And uh, I don't remember where this came from. But yeah, we got a little polka in the somewhere in there. And yep, there he is. I decided to put him in here where I can enjoy him all the time. Excuse me. 